Hi everyone, this is Velo Kaze. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to look at the uh, three things. So the first thing we are going to look at will be the new limit breaks for job lots, which took effect on mid April 2022. Next we will look at the table if you're using star gems or element of growth items to see how it will affect your promotion of your job lot. And then last but not least, we'll look at a tip or some tips to level up your job lots to level 70. So previously for job lots, it's uh, the maximum level, it's level 50. Uh, but now after the April update, you can actually upgrade your job lots to a limit of level 70. So if you look at the table here, which I've gotten from Play Mining's Medium website, which I will put a link in the show notes below. So to get a job lot to level 20 to 30, you need to have one original amulet and a duplicate to get the job lot from 20 to 30. To limit break it to two stars, you need to have one original job lot, two duplicates to get it from level 30 to level 40, and for three stars, which was previously the max, you, you need one original job lot and three duplicates to get the job lot from level 40 to 50. So of course, to upgrade the job lot to level 50, you have to use the sands, but you, in order to use the sands to upgrade them to level 50, you have to limit break them first. So always limit break them first, then you can upgrade to level 50. With the update, you will need much more amulets to limit break them to 4 stars and 5 stars. So in total, you're looking at at least 16 amulets. So one original job lord and 15 duplicates to limit break the job lord with a limit from level 20 to level 70 so 16 so if you look at it in a table for example if you use the crab fisherman you need three so one original two duplicates but if you are using star gems so basically you need one original and one star gem to get it to a max level of 30. And two stars will be one duplicate and three, one original, excuse me, and three duplicates to get it to a maximum level of level 40. If you're using star gems, if you look at the table here, it's one original and two star gems. So take note, it is quite important if you're using the element of growth, please get the job lot to at least three stars first. So with the maximum level of 50. So when you use the element of growth, it will grow the job lot from level one to 50. Always limit break it, limit break it to three stars first before using the element of growth. So after level 50, the element of growth will upgrade the job lot by 10 levels. So if you break, limit break it to 4 stars and you use 1 element of growth, it will grow the job lot from level 50 to 60. So if you have a 5 star job lot, so when you have 16 of the crab fishermen and you have limit break it to 5 stars, you can use First, one element of growth to get it to 50, the next element of growth to get it to 60, and the third element of growth to get it to 70. So three element of growth. So after level 50, the element of growth will only up your job lot by 10 levels. So for a level 50 four star job lot, you can level the job lot from 50 to 60. If your job lot is a level 55, five star job lot, you will level the job lot from 55 to 65. 
if you have a level 60 but a 5 star job lot, you can level it to 60 from level 60 to 70 with one element of growth. So please let me know if you have any questions on using the element of growth. But uh, essentially, you will need three elements of growth. If you are not using sands, three elements of growth items to get the job lot from level 1 to 70. So next, well, on tips on leveling job lots to level 70, I would recommend or suggest that you get at least three of your most powerful legendary or epic job lot to level 50 first before trying to limit break them to level 70 because the process to get them from 50 to 60 and 60 to 70 is a very very long process you will need many many duplicates 10 to 11 duplicates to get the job load from level 50 to 60 and 60 to 70 and if you're not using the element of growth you'll be using sands so you need a lot a lot of sands to get the job load from level 50 to 70 so i'll recommend for you or for new players to get your most powerful legendary or epic job loads to at least level 50 first so you can easily clear pve and you can participate in some pvp before looking at upgrading them to level 70. that's all i have for today thank you so much for listening and watching this video for more guides on job tribes please click and like and subscribe to my channel thank you for your support and take care see you